In front of me is a wheel that contains every country in the world. I have to spun that wheel and whatever country we land on, I have to try and draw the flag of that country from memory with no hints, no clues or anything other than the name of the country. Lebanon. Ooh. Okay, we've gone pretty obscure to begin with, but I think I know this one. I'm pretty sure it is red on the top and the bottom. I suppose it's not that obscure, but it's not like the French flag or something, you know what I mean? I think it's red on the top and the bottom. And then I think it's just what looks like kind of a Christmas tree. I'm assuming it isn't a Christmas tree, obviously, but it looks pretty similar. It's like this kind of thing. I mean, it's not great for me, but this should give us, yeah, that looks about right. Let's move it over a bit. Let's get it centered. Okay, that's what I'm going to lock in. All right, let's reveal the actual Lebanon flag, and I'd say I got that. Obviously, I could have made the tree a bit more detailed by doing this kind of thing, but for a Microsoft Paint version, I reckon that's a full point. Time to spin again. Let's see if we get somewhere equally obscure, or perhaps this time a little bit more obvious. What is it going to be? It is... Is. Oh, 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 Panama. Okay, I've definitely screwed this one up before. So I have to get Panama and the Dominican Republic mixed up, but I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna be bold. I think it's blue up here. Pull that in blue. And then I think it's red down here. Oh, am I doing this wrong? Am I drawing the Dominican flag? No, that looks okay. And then I need a red star. Yeah. And then a blue star, maybe, possibly. I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna lock that one in. Okay, let's reveal the actual Panama flag. Oh, I was really close. I got the colours the wrong way around. But in terms of the design, it's perfect. It's just the wrong way. Well, we'll give ourselves three quarters of a point for that one. Let's spin again and see what happens. So far, we're doing all right. We've definitely done a lot worse in this series before. Okay, what is it? And the answer is Tonga. Oh, okay. I know Tonga. It's, it, the whole thing's just come to me. It's red, and then I've got a white square up in the top. Yeah, looking good, looking good. Get that filled in. Very nice, very nice. And then I need a red cross, just like that. Well, not quite like that. It needs to be better than that, ideally. Let's just fill that in. Yeah, perfect. I'll just sort that little gap out as well. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Let me have another go. Yeah, there you go. That's better. That'll do. Right, I'm pretty sure I've got that one correct, but let's just make Make sure. Yeah, that's right. My cross is a bit high up, but that was just accidental. That's a full point. We'll go again. Let's see if the streak continues. All countries are up for grabs. Which country is it going to be next? And the answer is... Uh... Chad. Okay, that should be okay. The Chad flag is basically the Romanian flag, but a slightly different tone of yellow, I think. So I think it's blue, yellow, red. So let's lock that in and see how it looks. Blue, yellow. No, this is definitely wrong. I think it's red first, yeah, and then blue at the end. Let's try that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's that, but without the black lines. Ignore the black lines. Okay, let's have a look. <laughs> <laughs> I was right the first time. It was this way round. Oh, God. Oh. I was so confidently wrong as well. Okay, give me no points. I don't deserve anything there. This game's harder than you think, guys. Try it yourselves. And the next country flag that I have to draw from memory is Pakistan. That should be okay. Okay, so pretty sure we just have a big chunk of green and we fill that green in. I think the green, if anything, needs to be a little bit darker. Yeah, let's try that. There we go. That's more like it. And then I need the crest moon and the star. Now, Mercure 250 commented on the last video and they gave me a better tip for drawing a crescent. So I'm going to try that right now. Here we go. I just draw a circle inside the circle. Oh, you are an absolute genius. Oh, that is way better than the monstrosities I was coming up with previously. Is that right? As I look at that now, I don't think that's right. I think it needs to be bigger, doesn't it? I think this design takes up the whole side. Does it? Does that look right? Yeah, I'm going to lock that in. I'm not confident though. Let's reveal. Let's find out. Oh, I see what I've done. Oh, I'm a fool. I'm a dirty, rotten fool. Don't give me any points. I don't want him. Even though I wasn't that far away, I don't deserve them. Keep them away. Okay, we spin again. It is so weird how your brain, like, trips up on those kind of things. You've got all the components, but trying to put them all in the right place is tricky. Bahamas. Oh, God. I can visualize the Barbados flag, but the Bahamas flag, I don't know. I've got it. It's just come to me. I've stared blankly at nothing for a little while, and now I'm ready to go. I th wait, I've forgotten it again. 
<laughs> I've genuinely forgotten again. Hopefully it'll just come back to me. It's like this kind of thing, I think. Uh, blue, blue. Right, that looks like Argentina at the minute. Is it yellow in the middle? Yes, it is. It is yellow in the middle. And then I think the blue needs to be a little bit darker. Yeah. Is that yellow correct? It doesn't look quite right so far. So then it's a black triangle that I'm missing, like this kind of fella. And then that needs like totally filling in black. Yes, that looks right. Okay, I've possibly got something wrong here, but let's check. Nah, I've nailed it. That's a full point. Thanks very much. Okay, we're getting such a nice array of different flags from different continents in this video. This is fantastic. Okay, where are we going to have next? The next country flag that we are drawing is... <gasps> Slovakia, European. Slovakia is not the easiest flag in the world to draw. Uh, how does it go? Blue like that, yeah. And then is it white in the middle? Possibly? But it could be red in the middle. No, I'll go white in the middle and then it's like a red crest, I think. The Slovakia and the Slovenia flag are really similar, so I might end up drawing the wrong one. Okay, let me just colour all of this in and see how it's looking. Yeah, that looks good. Ah, it doesn't look great, though. What else do I need to do? There's mountains. Yeah, we, we got some white mountains that need to be added. I don't quite know how much space the white mountains take up. Let me just colour those in. Okay, I'm going to get rid of the bottom half. Yeah, this isn't quite right, is it? What else do I need to have here? There's a cross. There is a cross. <laughs> More is just coming to me bit by bit. It's like that. This is a definitely not quite right. But I don't think it's going to be a million miles away. I might... Ah, oh, I wish I knew what I was doing wrong. Um, I think it's a white cross. This is going to be so weird if it's wrong, but it's just come to me now. I feel like the cross like has some like pointiness halfway, and I think it then changes to blue. <laughs> what am I doing? That can't be right. What is this? I'm gonna lock it in. I'm gonna see where I've gone wrong. Right, let's reveal the actual Slovakian flag. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I kind of actually screwed that up really bad, didn't I? That's no points. Not even the background's correct. Yeah, I uh, I do not deserve anything there. Here we go. What is it gonna be? Cannot wait to draw another flag. And it is... Oh, it says subscribe. Thanks very much. If you haven't already, it's completely free. And you can just unsubscribe if you change your mind later. Please help me get more subscribers than the population of Mauritius. Cheers. <laughs> oh, wait, no, sorry. It says Saudi Arabia. I don't know what happened there. All right, Saudi Arabian flag isn't too difficult to do, I don't think. It's definitely not going to be particularly accurate, I will be honest, but basically, there is a sword, which is quite a cool looking sword, actually. It's like this kind of... Oh, that doesn't look great. Uh, <laughs> let me... Yeah, there we go. We fixed it. And then the sword needs colouring in. I'm going to leave the two loops. And then there's a foreign language, which I would not be able to draw accurately, but simplified, it kind of looks like this sort of thing. I mean, this is probably somewhat slightly offensive, but it's the best a white British person such as myself could do. So let's just get that centered and then color in the gap. Oh, oh no. Okay, let's have another go. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> All right, let's reveal the actual Saudi Arabian flag. Oh, I got the sword the wrong way. And my squiggles are definitely way too squiggly. The color is correct, though. Uh, let's just give ourselves half a point and say no more about it. Okay, I'm spinning this wheel again. Let's do two more and see how we get on. The next country flag that we will be drawing from memory is <gasps> Mali. Uh, nothing is coming to me. Nothing at all. Literally not a single thing. Wait, no. It's just come to me. <laughs> it's a tricolor flag, isn't it? It's three stripes, but I'm not 100% sure on the colors. Right, what we'll do is we'll do it step by step. I'm pretty sure it's green on this side. Let's color that in green. Is the other side red? I think the other side's red. Yeah, and then in the middle, yellow. Yeah, that looks all right, doesn't it? Just gonna chop off a bit of the green because it's kind of too uneven. Yeah, we'll lock that in. I possibly got some of the colors in the wrong order, but let's find Find out. Yeah, the order's wrong. What I think I've done there is the guinea flag. On screen right now is the guinea flag. But at least we got the colours, we got the stripes, but I, once again, I screwed up on the order. So I'll just take another half a point, please. Thank you. Right, I am spinning again. Where are we going to land this time? We have got Guatemala. Oh, God. Guatemala is a really difficult flag. Or at least I think it is. What I've got in my head is uh, not something I'm going to be able to draw. I'm pretty sure there's a snake and a gun. Okay, it's Central American. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the blue on the top and the bottom. The nice light blue. But genuinely, this already might be incorrect. So yeah, we'll try that. I think what's next is like a cool kind of gold chain in a circle, which uh, I'm kind of struggling to draw. But we'll see what happens. 
yeah, that'll do. Nice, well done, Jack. That's great. Let me try the other way around now as well. Yeah, uh, this is not going ideal thus far. But, you know, as long as it gets the point across, that's all we really need. This is going to be so weird if I'm just thinking of the complete wrong thing. And I just create something that isn't even remotely close. Is there two guns? Are the guns, like, crossed? I don't think they are. I think there's just one. I'll try just drawing one. I don't even know how to draw it. It's like a big rifle, like, like this kind of thing. I don't know how to draw guns. Like, something like that? Yeah, sure. I really have no idea what a gun looks like, it turns out. Well, I suppose that's not a bad thing. It's like this, isn't it? Yeah, and then I need the little trigger down here. Just shove that in like that. Cool. Pull that in, kind of. Yeah. Right, well, we'll draw a snake now because I actually have no idea what else to do. <laughs> What is this? I'm really getting out of my depth now. <laughs> right, let's make him a bit more detailed. Let's get some nice stripes on our snake. Why not? This just kind of adds to it a little bit. You know what I mean? Let's give him a little tongue as well. There you go. A little forked tongue. Well, that's nice. And then uh, he's got a little eyeball and a little pupil. <laughs> What have I done? Okay, I'm actually really intrigued to find out what the Guatemalan flag looks like. I don't think it's this. Okay, here we go. Right. Okay. Well, you can see what my brain's done there. The rifles do cross. I've got one of them in the correct place. And then my brain has gotten the bird's fantails mixed up with the length of a snake. The gold chains are completely wrong. They're supposed to be green leaves. And also, I'm missing the paperwork completely. And I've just noticed that my blue stripes are in the wrong place. So even though I don't really deserve any points there, I'm still kind of proud of it. <laughs> New Guatemala flag proposal. Save. <laughs> okay, that's a good one. Well done. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you have not already. Let me know what I should do for the next Drawing Flags from Memory video, and I will see you all later.